to me. Because the United States of America is spending so much energy against the Muslims, there must be a reason why. Why did, are they focusing their attention so much on the Muslims? Muslims are enemies. Why? What are they preparing the people for? In, the, in Great Britain, there's a magazine put out by some Muslim youth called Trends. And brothers and sisters, you must be as wise as the people of this world who study trends. They don't just look at what's happening, they make projections. What happens if the Muslims continue at this pace that they're going? Six million, seven million, eight million Muslims in America, 10 million, 20 million Muslims in America? They think like that. They said, oh, Suraj Wahaj, he's got nine babies. Now, if each of one of them have nine children, Imam Alameen got 30 children. Now, if they get married and they have all these children, they start thinking, they start calculating. But they don't calculate just tomorrow, they calculate 10 years from now, 100 years from now, 1,000 years from now, because they're smart, they understand trends. And you, brothers and sisters, and I, I leadership, must understand trends. I gave a lecture in the University of Michigan, and when the lecture was over, it was attended by many Jews. A Jewish professor, a woman, said, Mr. Imam Siraj Wahaj, tell me, if Muslims become the, pop, uh, the um, majority of people in this country, and if you vote, would you then vote to implement the Sharia? What you say? How many Muslims have attended this convention? There are 10,000 seats in this hall. And yesterday, at the peak of the session, about 80% of this hall was full.